after a beautiful rainfall, it is a day of homemaking and just taking part in my family and curating my home to be a place that I love. So today I want to talk about intentional rest and what that looks like for me. I have come to realize that each person rests differently. Some of us may rest by sitting and watching a TV show. Some of us rest by reading a book. And some of us rest by getting outdoors, taking walks, sitting in the morning, reading our devotionals with our spouse, and just finding those pockets of time throughout the day for rest. And that is more of who I am. I really try to prioritize my day so I can get tasks accomplished and so I can spend time with my girls, with my husband, and resting. And like I said, resting looks different for each of us. So we are going to just do my day, um, interact with who I am and what I do with my three kiddos, my husband home in the morning before he heads off to work, always makes my coffee for me, um, shows a little love as well in some ways. And there's just always things that are happening in this house that create um, interruptions on tasks and that is okay. I enjoy sitting down and reading while I nurse my little boy to my girls. It's just kind of been a time that I have created um, to be able to spend time with them and then find little times to do little cleaning projects like cleaning out my little coffee stand Berkey filter station that we have that hasn't been wiped out in months. So just find little pockets of time to get these tasks done and cleaning to me is not always stressful. It's not like ugh begrudging thinking about having to go clean but it's something I enjoy because it's so satisfying to see the after effects of what cleaning really is and literally five minutes that's all it took I was reheating my coffee wiped a few things down um, just interacting with my girls as well because they were playing with some dolls and just you know getting things done while being part of my mothering wipes of the chairs is a constant daily and so that's again another three to four minute little task um, I had been canning quite a bit so there's a bunch of grease and like just water spots up higher on my cabinets that I thought okay I'll take a little vinegar lemon essential oils water spray and get that off of there clean my stove off a little bit and just get some of the gunk that builds up in the summer months that I don't typically take care of because um, we're just busier in the summer with outdoor time and snuggles when little ones need your attention I've had to learn to stop pick them up or get down to their level Spend a few minutes with them go play with the little dolls Just take five ten minutes to interact with them here and there throughout the day and That is something that I find important I don't always just focus on tasks and I don't always just spend time with kids. There is a balance and I think that's how I do get things done is you have to balance work life as a homemaker and mom life and you get to train them along the way. So we're making their little gummy bears and just enjoying having them learn how to do that in the way that they can and helping them along the way. Um, making sure they learn well, but also letting them figure it out on their own. It's so important as a mother to train to be a homemaker to your children, your little girls and your little boys. had to be tested of course after they were frozen for a little while and so a few snitches here and there of the gummy bears and they were totally children and mom approved.
spending time outside for me is so restful and relaxing even if it means trimming my dead flowers and just getting cut flowers for my little girl to make a little bouquet for herself and I just again another probably 10-15 minute task is all it took to cut this giant baby's breath plant that I had because all the flowers were no longer in bloom so it's just taking those moments while the girls are playing and little ones napping to just do tasks that need to get done and I found it so restful like gardening for me is a solace it's a place of rest where my mind can just kind of wander and I can just pray I can just smell all the scents that the earth and the ground bring and create like I said that little bouquet for my little girl to have in her little vase. My cleaned up garden looks so much better after deadheading multiple flowers and then just catching glimpses of beauty with a butterfly buzzing and flying around from here to there. And who knew that we could enjoy weeds in a yard so much as this Creeping Jenny brings to us. Just bring that little joy to my girls' hearts to be able to pick. So this is when I really prioritize my time. You can see toys are still on the floor. It's nap time. I grabbed my Americano and I am working on my blog, on my videos. And this is a time of rest for me because it's something I enjoy so much. It's not stressful to create and be creative and share that with you guys. I enjoy it and love it so much. So it's not something that I just, again, sigh about and think I gotta just get it done. It's something that I look forward to every day. And getting outside again for strolls and walks with all my kiddos. It's just, these are little pockets of rest that I take time to have throughout my day. So I think that's what's important for you to recognize is what is rest like for you? Is it the one who just sits down to read a book or watches a show? Or are you like me and you enjoy just being outside? You enjoy um, being creative, whether that be through... Um, social media whether that be cooking and this supper tonight is just our pancake night and just again that's something I enjoy so I don't I just don't find homemaking to be stressful um there are times with mothering and things that I do really want to get done that I can be weighing heavy on my mind and wanting to get things done but just thinking about how am I looking at homemaking as just an always task to get done or just as caring for the home and the family and the place that God has provided for us. So as I finish out the night of just, again, being outside in God's creation, sweeping off my deck, thinking about the day, um, my oldest is still awake, so she's outside with me, and just kind of resetting the outdoor space for the next day too. It's just something I wanted to share, knowing that I rest differently than you rest, and we all need to find what works best for us and what works best for us so that we can be rejuvenated to care for our spaces and our family. On that note, I'm going to enjoy my tea with my husband and relax with him for the evening. Hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. Love you guys.